So what's good, homies? It's your man, Dr. BOA. I'm going to say something now that's going to shock a lot of you. But we kind of owe Jada Pinkett Smith an apology. Now, before you go and cut the video off, I guarantee you when I'm done with this video, at least 50% of you will agree. So stick around and see if you're a part of that 50%. Now, we have talked extensively about how Jada Pinkett is treating Will Smith, how she's publicly embarrassing the man, how she's treating him as if he doesn't matter, how she's treating him as if he's less than a man. Somebody sent me a video on IG that kind of makes you question whether he is a man at all. Sometimes you do things, man, and you think about the consequences later. And there are other things you do that the consequences of those things should stop you before you ever do them. Will Smith is on the set of Bad Boys 2. His wife, Jada Pinkett, is there. She's giving him a massage. And he's ooh and ah and ouch and doing all that like she's killing him. His brother-in-law comes and gives him a massage. And what he says following this is terrible. But even more terrible is the embarrassing look on his wife's face when he does that for the sake of getting a laugh. This shines a new light on this entire situation. But let's take a look at this video, man. We'll come back and chop it up on a real tip. Change, do uh, only a man knows what a man needs. Now, what you see in this video is a man who's a prankster. He's a funny guy. He's really a funny guy. But this act has nothing to do with comedy. It has nothing to do with humor. It has something to do with disrespect. But not just for his wife. Disrespect for himself. Disrespect for manhood and masculinity. No man should ever say something like this. If these are the type of things that he does regularly, and I'm going to be honest with you, I saw the guy kiss Uncle Phil in the mouth on The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, so he's been doing weird old things like this for a long time. But for that man to feel another man's hands on his shoulder, give him a massage and respond the way he does, and then say out loud that it takes a man to know what a man likes. Let me tell you something, brothers. That woman has every right to respond to that man the way she does if this is the type of thing he does on a regular basis. This makes no sense. This is not a positive thing. And it wasn't even funny. It's just a situation where this man doesn't understand the damage that he's doing to his own relationship. That woman was downright embarrassed. She was embarrassed. She couldn't believe he said that, but not just said it, said it in front of the whole set, man. There's nothing funny about this. If you think that's funny, then something's wrong with you. Men have to hold themselves accountable for the energy they perpetuate in their own marriages. You have to do that. Now, am I saying that Will doing this means that he deserves all of the things this woman has done? No, I'm not saying he deserves any of the actions that she's done. But I do understand her energy toward him now. If these are the types of things that he does. Can you imagine ever saying that? I can't. I don't think any of you can. And if you did say it. Would you expect your woman to be okay with it? Would you expect your wife to be okay with it? Would you expect her to go right along with it and act like it's no big deal? I don't think you would. So why are you expecting that from Jada Pinkett? Why are you expecting her to be out there on the set in front of all these people when her man pretty much says, a man knows how to please a man more than a woman does. Come on, bro. Y'all know that's wrong. Y'all know that's foul. Y'all know that's cutthroat. Y'all know that man shouldn't have never said that around this woman. Y'all know that. 
And this is the type of energy that he's putting out there, man. Then I see why she's having all these red table talk. Because that boy is embarrassing. That boy is hella embarrassing, man. I ain't never seen nothing like it. That boy is too embarrassing. Has the audacity to say that with that woman right there, man. Now, here's another thing about this. that You have to keep in mind that as long as they've been in a relationship, man, they can't afford many missteps like this. And you know how a woman is. A woman gets vindictive. You embarrass her one time, she's got to embarrass you five. It's not a woman's fault. It's not good. It's not bad. It's just true. This is what women do. And you ain't know this is men. So you know when you embarrass this woman, she's going to embarrass you. The problem is Will didn't know it was embarrassing. To Will saying, you know, given uh, this type of innuendo is normal for him. And obviously it's not normal for Jay, at least not anymore. The truth of the matter is this. If you want to be respected as a man, you got to behave like one. If you don't care about respect, being respected as a man, behave however you want to. Because there's a line, a cutoff line for manhood and masculinity. Anything below that line is not manhood and it's not masculine. And that's just the way it is. So, Will, man, we've been out here going to bat for you, man. Doing all this, man. Talking about you, man. You know, talking about the woman, man. Making sure that, you know, you know, man, that we here for you, man. You reach on out. Then you turn around, man, and let this type of thing happen, bro where we get to see some information where you are doing things that will probably lead a woman to mistreat you a little bit. Probably need lead a woman to not treat you so masculine in a way. Because if you'll be out in public doing that, there is no telling the type of thing she has to deal with at home. Y'all coming down with don't let me know what you think about this topic, man. I look forward to hearing what you men have to say. I'm out. Down is the motto. Beta's claiming to be alpha.